Really busy on Rollercoin at the moment. We've even got the elections going on on Rollercoin and the Space Miner Progression event, which is one of those miners you will need for that Mega Craft as well. Let's find out all the details right here on that Tego Guy. Stay tuned. Okay, so cool event at the moment is the election. So I'm just going to jump right into it. On my screen here, you can see the Rollercoin homepage and one of the titles under the events now is election event. So if we click on election event, you will see these cute hamsters battling it out. We've also got Pear Pear there as well. So this is basically a nice event where you actually buy tickets. Okay, so you'll be able to buy one ticket, I think every 12 or so hours here and you'll be able to cast your vote. I'm not sure if it's 12 hours or 24 hours, but for one RLT, you'd be able to buy a ticket to participate in this. This is very similar to those puzzle events, okay? But there's no puzzle this time, but the way this progression, the campaigner path works is very similar to that. Basically, you're collecting the American flags here, the little American flags, and each time you vote, you can then, uh, each time you buy a ticket, you can vote for either thump or hemepair okay so you can put that there and then you'll be also in the leaderboard here uh, where you can win some amazing prizes like gold passes and miners and things like that even more rlt and rst as well so uh, be sure to actually try and gain those points so i don't have many at the moment so i voted once already for the thumb team voted twice for the Mepe team. I don't know if I'm saying that right. But anyway, the blue side and the red side. There we go. Here are all the details at the bottom here. So you decide who will win, okay? Now, obviously, this is not just uh, a fictitious thing. It will actually come to fruition. So the promises that these hamsters are making, depending on who wins at the moment, we've got Hemepe in the lead, okay? Uh, the promises they're making are down here and those will actually come to fruition in real life when the election ends, but they will last only for three weeks. So who are you going to vote for? So if you, do, if you vote for Team Thump, the promises are increase random crypto block rewards by 50%, extend the progression event multiplayer duration for the entire event, Enable crafting and sales exclusively for crypto. Increase the price of miners from season store by 10%. Power rewards for games boosted by times 10. On the other hand, if you vote for Team Hamerpe, increase RLT block reward by 100%. Wow. Lower price of pass cases from the season store by 10%. Decrease the dodge block reward by 99%. All subsequent miners to be can't be sold only and game cooldowns will be slashed by times three. These will be there for three weeks, okay? So it's for a period of three weeks after the election ends, okay? So those will be implemented depending on which team will win. There's a couple of fact here that you can check out as well. The main thing is that you will be actually gaining here as well. You'll be gaining these rewards depending on how many flags you get. Each flag will cost you one vote. So technically speaking, you'll be spending 40 RLT to get to the very end where you can get Mr. President with a whopping 3.4 petahash. Okay, so this can't be sold, this minor. So you can only get it exclusively in this event. Uh, a few days ago, I don't know if it, yes, it was yesterday or not, but there was actually a corruption event which lasted a few hours where you could actually buy one of these tickets before as well. I do believe that there were some people actually selling tickets on the marketplace, but I don't know if that is being done anymore. So let me just check that out as well. So if we go to ticket. Yep, there is. There are 393 tickets, but obviously they're being sold for a premium price of 651 per ticket at the time of recording this video okay so as you can see the price has significantly gone up okay so if you don't want to wait for that 12 hours or 24 hours i'm not totally sure on the timing exactly uh 
to spend only one RLT to buy the ticket, then you can actually get it through the marketplace as well. Um, and the, yesterday or the day before, there was that corruption event where you can actually buy that. Uh, I think it was in the sales and popular. Okay, so you can actually buy a ticket, and it was for two RLT. So um, you could only buy one. I'm not totally entirely sure how uh, you players out there are actually getting all those tickets, but that is interesting and uh, this event is going on until the 23rd of august there are 13 days 7 hours and 51 minutes remaining at the time of recording this video so make sure to try and get all of those rewards there i'm on my way to getting the nice presidential office roller presidential office there you go so that is the current event where you can vote and those are the roller elections going on at the moment also at the moment there is currently the progression event so the space miner progression event as you can see here at the top i've collected all of the rewards so i've gotten all of them both space miners because there are two and you actually need this space miner as one of your nine miners to be able to do that mega craft at the end where you will get 28.8 petahash with that mega miner. More details, we can see that this event still has two days, seven hours and 50 minutes remaining. So you've got the entire weekend plus a little more to be able to complete the entire event and get all the rewards, at least one of the space miners, which you will need for that mega craft. Okay, so that space miner gives you 1.25 petahash. Basically, the rewards here were the typical ones, 500 points for going to a higher difficulty level in a game, but we'll go through a few more details for the points as well. I can confirm as well that you do actually get six hours as multiplier duration. I completed this with a times 13, and then I gave it a slight boost to times 14, okay? So majority of it, I did it with times 13, and then I said, I'm just gonna put times one, so I exchanged another 10 RLT to be able to do that and I actually completed the entire progression event with a times 14 multiplier. As usual, thanks to Piero, we're going to go through the list of rewards which we can see right here. This is a 30 level progression event and there are two space miners, one at level 25 and one at level 30, so at least try to do your best to make it to level 25. You could always buy the space miner on the marketplace. I believe the last I checked, it was at around 47 RLT. Let's check how much it is now. So there we go, 48.4 RLT at the moment. Uh, so you could do that and not do the entire progression event, but that way you'd be spending 48 RLT and only getting this space miner. I think I would actually try and convert from crypto to RLT because you will be getting more rewards on the way, as you can see in the list. And the total amount of miners power that you can receive if you get all of the miners in this progression event will be 5.78 petahash. The miners bonus that you will get, so the bonus that is attached to the miners will be a total of 8.34%. And those obviously count only if you put the miners in the room and if you already don't have the miners, okay? So for one of the miners, you will get the, um, the bonus. So if there's, for example, two Wednesday Frogos here and the, they're of the same type. So both of these are common, okay? So you'll, you'll get a 0.5% bonus with Wednesday Frogo, but for the second Wednesday Frogo, you're not gonna get the other 0.5% bonus, but you can potentially merge those two miners to receive an even more powerful miner and more bonus power as well, okay? The Meme King there at level 29 with 855 terahash and a 1% bonus as well. And starting from the very top, you start off with easy stuff, 10 RST, then you get 0.1 of an RLT as well. There's more RST here and you can get a total of 185 RST if you complete the entire progression event or at least get to level 16 to get the last RST reward in the list. There are zero season EXP points, but there is also temporary power of 2.5 petahash, starting with the one at level four, where you get bonus power, one petahash for seven days, 
and there is more bonus power at level 19 and at level 26 but the one at level 26 the one petahash will last you for two weeks and the one at level 19 with the 500 terahash will last you also for two weeks okay so it's only the first one that will last you a week i know it's temporary power but it does help during those weeks to give you that little bit of an extra boost so i'm going to leave a link to piero's site like i always do below the description uh, below this video in the description and you can check out all the rewards at your leisure but basically what you need to know for this progression event is that you definitely need to at least try and get one of those space miners okay and i would do that by exchanging like i did uh, at the moment i am actually on solana for those of you who ask me what coin are you mining and what how are you making your profits and what are you doing to be able to get rlt so that is what i'm doing i am putting all of my power onto solana at least for now sometimes i do change that and i put it on rlt itself when i need more rlt and the way i got through this progression event was basically the usual uh, playing games priming those games uh, so be sure to check out my tips and tricks to know how to actually use the multipliers efficiently and effectively but at least this time you do get six hours like the previous progression event there was as well so it will give you more time and if you actually exchange only one rlt when the six hours are almost up you'll get another six hours okay so this progression event is on until the 11th of august 3 p.m utc time as I was going through earlier, game difficulty for each and every game difficulty that you increase, you get 500 points. Spending one RLT anywhere except in the marketplace and in the crafting offer, you get 1,000 points. In the marketplace, it's 100 points. And in the crafting offer, it's 5,000 points. Okay, so look out for those crafting offers, especially when you have the multiplier so that you can gain a lot of points there with the multiplier as well and you'll be able to complete the progression event even faster at the moment there is the death offer which at the time of recording this video this is on for another 7 hours and 43 minutes so it's basically today you've got today to be able to complete that okay so you can see the variations here you can spend rlt to get that or you can decide to spend bitcoin as well and you do need to have some of the miners this this guy was in the uh, previous progression event and i managed to get both of those as well so that's basically it elections at the moment which are hot and the progression event space miner which is currently going on i hope that you did find this video useful if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel please do so down below smash the like button and hit that notification bell to be notified when new videos do come out on my channel and until next time take very good care of yourselves and thanks for watching